Well, this morning calls from Democrats for Mecklenburg State Representative Trisha Cotham to resign. It comes after the North Carolina lawmaker announced she was leaving the Democratic Party and joining Republicans on the other side of the aisle. The move now officially giving the GOP enough power to override a veto from Democratic Governor Roy Cooper. From Raleigh to the heart of Charlotte. What are we asking Trisha to do? Resign! Democrats now demanding Representative Trisha Cotham to step down. This decision is not only bad for democracy, but it also undermines the trust of voters in their elected officials. Cotham elected as a Democrat back in November with nearly 59% of the vote. But now she says she's changing course. The modern day Democratic Party has become unrecognizable to me and to so many others throughout this state and this country. She says she felt pressure to fall in line with the Democratic Party. I've suffered many attacks since I've been up here from Democrats in the party, from blasting me on Twitter to calling me names to going after my family. Cotham's decision now handing the GOP a huge victory in the General Assembly. If the party sticks together, Republicans would be able to override any veto from Democratic Governor Roy Cooper. Representative Cotham's decision to switch parties is a deceit of the highest order. It is a betrayal to the people of Mecklenburg County with repercussions not only for the people of her district, but for the entire state of North Carolina. Cotham still not committing to position changes on key issues like abortion, meaning it's still unclear if she could end up voting with Democrats on some of these bills.